down to that turn off we talked about, the Hollyford turn off there. And um, for a lot of years there's been talk about putting this road in. So if road um, started in 1936, 1936, as you can imagine, this sort of environment it was really tough. Now I'll just stop that story for a minute. A lot of avalanches and a lot of rock falls in this area. So to our left, they call this the Red Slip. Okay, so this thing came down in uh, uh, 2012, and it came down across the road, crossed the creek, and went up the other side. <coughs> and um, it's monitored these days. They say it's still moving. But they put monitors in the in the uh, rubble there. And very, very sadly, a young man lost his life when they were clearing the road. It took them months to clear it, so everybody that was in Milford had to be flown out, uh, and you couldn't actually get vehicle access through. Um, I think it was, a, it was about three weeks before they opened one lane, but it was only just at certain times of the day. So you've got rockfall up here, you've also got, and uh, it's not, you can tell it's an avalanche because it's sort of rough. You know, it's not like just fallen snow, which tends to be quite smooth. So again, the road crew monitors all that. They have monitoring stations throughout the mountains here, and they will be measuring the snowpack, and if the snowpack gets too 